assalamu alaikum friends welcome to my channel mbbs mbds lectures today our topic is related to community dentistry fits and vision cement before going to explanation if you want to watch the same lecture in urdu hindi i already upload same lecture in urdu hindi on my youtube channel go and watch the video but if you want to watch in english language then this video is for you now today topic is fits and fission cement in today video we will study the definition and types of fits and fission uh, cement in in second video we will study the methods of application of fits and fission cement and in last third video we will study the indication and contraindication of fits and fission cement now before going to definition of fits and fission cement first we should understand what is fit and what is fission on the occlusal surface of posterior teeth there is a longitudinal groove these longitudinal grooves is called fission what is fit along with grooves on a proximal surface of posterity there is a depression this depression is called fit now what is fit fit is actually a depression which present on the occlusal surface of posterior teeth what is groove grooves uh, what is fissure a longitudinal grooves which present on the occlusal surface of posterior teeth is called fissure now the best place for bacteria on top surface is fits and fissure because fits and fissure is the best shelter for bacteria when we eat food the food debris go and enter in fits and fissure and uh, in fits and fissure now when we do brushing the bristles of brush does not reach the fits and fissure to clean the fits and fissure therefore the food debris accumulated in fits and fissure here the calculus form and here the form uh, the flag form and here bacteria start uh, a sit position and the caries process will be start now the occlusal surface the fits and fissure surface of tooth if we compare with the other surfaces of tooth it is only 12% of total tooth surface mean fits and fissure is only 12% of total tooth surface but 50% caries occur in fits and fissure and if we compare with the other smooth surfaces of the tooth there are eight times more caries occurrence occur in fits and fissure if compare with the smooth surfaces therefore we should seal the fits and fissure to stop to block the shelter of bacteria therefore we use fits and fissure cement now first we start from definition of fits and fissure cement what is fits and fissure cement fits and fissure cement is a material which applied professionally mean health professionals doctors applied fits and fissure cement why to seal the pits and fissure why it is applied to seal it to seal the pits and fissure why seal pits and fissure in order to close the shelter of bacteria in order to close the shelter of bacteria this is the definition of pits and fissure cement now come to the types of cement types of pits and fissure cement the types of fissure fissure cement are formed on two bases 
नंबर वन ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ जनरेशन नंबर टू ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ टाइम ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ टाइम ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ जनरेशन देर आर फर्स्ट जनरेशन फिर से मेजर सिलेंट सेकेंड जनरेशन एंड थर्ड जनरेशन फर्स्ट जनरेशन फिर से विजुअल सिलेंट इज लाइट क्यूर मीन दी सिलेंट आर क्यूर बाय लाइट सेकेंड जनरेशन फिर से विजुअल सिलेंट इज सेल क्यूर द थर्ड जनरेशन फिर से विजुअल सिलेंट इज आल्सो लाइट क्यूर बट व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन फर्स्ट जनरेशन एंड थर्ड जनरेशन बोथ आर लाइट क्यूर लाइट क्यूर बट first generation is ultraviolet light pure and third generation is blue light light pure this is the basic difference between first and third generation now come to the second generation second generation is cell cured cell cured mean this consist of monomer plus catalyst and without light in the absence of light because here catalyst is present there will be polymerization of monomers in result the material will be set mean on the basis of generation first generation second generation third generation first generation is light cured which is ultraviolet light cured second generation is self cured consist of monomer plus catalyst third generation is light cured mean blue light cured this is the first uh, uh, type of bit uh, reduction cylinder on the basis of generation now second is types on the basis of types types on the basis of types there are two types type a type b in type a the four types of pits and fissure cement is come in type b three types of pits and fissure cement is come first in type a plastics plastic cements are present in type a classification now in plastic cement for example polyurethane polyurethane is a first plastic pits and fissure cement which launch in market but due to its soft nature its structure break down occur within 3 months thereby its use is limited nowadays second is resin based cement now resin based cement is have very good sealing property and have a good strength it consist of resin it is uh, set by self cure or light third is in gic glass isomer cement we also use glass and or cement as a fits and fissure cement why due to its anti kerogenic activity why anti kerogenic activity due to fluoride release fourth is fluoride containing cement mean those cement which consist of fluoride these have also anti kerogenic activity and anti kerogenic effect and resistance to kerogenic development these four fits and fissure cement are come in type a now come to the type b in type b the first pits and fissure cement is filled and unfilled cement what is filled and unfilled filled pits and fissure cement have pillar particle which give two properties to pits and fissure cement the first property filled cement due to filler filled cement is heavy and due to heaviness due to weight its penetration its penetration is good in grooves in fissures therefore its sealing activity is good its penetration is good the second property which give by pillar is strength this is filled and un second is light cured and self cured light cured and self cured are also come in type d light cured pure by blue light and self cure consist of catalyst and monomer due to polymerization of monomer its setting take place now come to the third 
clear and tinted with surface sealant. Now one, one is clear and other is tinted. Tinted being colored like white color, yellow color and pink color. Now which is best? Clear or tinted? Clear or tinted? Clear is best because it is aesthetically acceptable. It is matched with the tooth color but the tinted color is not matched with the tooth color like pink and yellow. Therefore, we prefer the clear fit surface sealant. Now today we studied the definition of fit surface sealant, types of fit surface sealant. Now today our topic is complete. In next video, we will study the methods of application, indication and contraindication of fit surface sealant. Now today our topic is complete. If you like my video, press the like button and share this video with your friends. If you are new to my channel, subscribe my channel by pressing the red subscribe button and also press the bell icon to open all notifications in order to receive my each new video notification. For watching my videos, I am very thankful to you. Thank you very much.